I'm a mess. I'm actually a mess. Maybe I should think before I talk. So maybe I should think before. Maybe next time I'll think before I talk. Hey friends, it's Ash. Welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. I'm in like a really weird place in my house right now. Like I'm literally sitting in front of my back door, but it's good lighting. And plus, I need to be here because all of my dorm stuff is here because today we're doing a dorm shopping haul. I really wanted to do a vlog of me shopping for you guys, but my process ended up being like me buying 90% of my stuff online. So there really wouldn't have been a lot of footage from that. I hope to make up for it with this haul because I got a lot of exciting stuff that I can't wait to show you guys. I have my whole aesthetic planned out. It's gonna look bomb. And if my dorm doesn't make it on Pinterest, then I'm suing. So before we get started with the video, I just wanna say if you are new here, then hi, welcome. Please be sure to hit subscribe somewhere down below if you want to see more of me because I'm definitely going to be posting a lot more college related content now that I'm actually going to college so if you want to see that be sure to stick around and give this video a like and hit me up on Instagram so yeah without further ado let's just get right into the video so the first thing that I got is this white comforter um I think I got this from Macy's but I'm not entirely sure but then again like it's just a white comforter you can find this anywhere it's super soft it'll keep me warm during the winter yeah what more can I say about it so the next two things that I got are these bed sheets I got one in white and one in gray I just hit myself in the face with that string love that but i got one in white and one in gray because i'm probably going to be too lazy to wash my sheets every week so now i have two sets to switch them out and i think i got this set from target and this set from macy's <laughs> they both just fall on the floor we love that also all of the beds at drexel are twin xl so that's probably standard for all colleges so just Make sure to look for that when you're buying bed sheets. Next thing that I got are these two red throw pillows from Amazon. I got these in like a set and I had to get the filler separately. My aesthetic is like black, white, metallics, and this like red wine color because this is my favorite color and I wanted to have like splashes of it throughout the dorm. So I'm really happy that I found these. They're like the perfect shade, I guess and they're velvet so they feel super nice i'm really happy about these they're really comfy too the next thing that i got is also another pillow from amazon and it is this like rectangle black ruffle pillow and i thought this was really cool because it is a different texture from everything else that i got and it's black so it'll look really good matched with the white and the red so the next thing i'm going to show you guys is this giant throw blanket from Bed Bath & Beyond and I got this to match with the pillows. Thankfully, they're the same shade. I know some people like when they tried buying matching pillows and blankets separately, it just like didn't work out, but thankfully it did. This is literally the softest thing I've ever felt. It's so fuzzy and it thankfully doesn't shed after I washed it. So just keep that in mind if you're gonna buy something like this. Can't wait to just cuddle up in this when the weather gets cold because Philly gets really, really cold in the winters. Okay, so the next thing I got is this, oh, this is my mattress topper, and it's wrapped in a bunch of plastic, so I'm not going to take it out because that's going to be super inconvenient later, but basically, I just got this because I hear that the beds at Drexel are not that comfy, and this will be really helpful because it's memory foam, so I can actually sleep at night because I need sleep, desperately. And I think I got this mattress pad from Bed Bath & Beyond. Okay, so like the next thing that I wanted to show you guys is actually already vacuum sealed in a bag. I don't want to like open the bag and then all of the air just comes flying back in. So I'm just going to show you the bag. Sorry about that. But <laughs> basically, so this white thing down here, this is the mattress topper. Wait. Oh my god, no, this was the mattress pad that I showed you. This is the mattress topper. I have no idea what my dorm supplies are, I'm sorry. But I apparently this is supposed to like go over the mattress pad and then the sheets go over this. I don't really know. I just heard that these two things were kind of essential for college students. And then these red things are the towels that I got. I explained this, I think, in like one of my vlogs when I went to actually go buy these. But basically my roommates and I we each picked a color for our towels so we don't mix them up and i chose red because 
It's my favorite color. I'm a little obsessed. It's kind of a problem. But yeah, so I have, I think like two or three bath towels in here, one washcloth, and then like one hand cloth. So the mattress topper I got at Macy's, I believe. And the towels I also got, I got one of them from Macy's. The rest I got from Bed Bath & Beyond. So yeah. So the next thing I got is this gray laundry hamper from Amazon. I don't want to like take it out of the packaging because then that's just going to be super inconvenient for me later when I move in. But I actually have this already here at home. It's super convenient because it has these handles so I can just pick it up and take it to the laundry room and zero hassle. I'm sorry, did my camera just move? So the next thing I have here is this trash can because when I'm lonely, I'll still have my twin. Okay, I'm kidding. But really, you need a trash can because I don't, okay, I don't know if my college gives us trash cans, but if they do, then it's probably going to be the really small ones that like won't hold anything. So I got this one just in case. This I got at Walmart, I believe. Yeah, it's really cool because it's got like the step on thing and the pop tops off like that. And wait, is there stuff in here? Oh, what the hell? Dude, I've got like a bunch of command hooks and stuff in here. Okay, I mean, I might as well show you guys these because they're in here. So like, I got this like hook key ring thing because obviously we're gonna need our keys for our room. And I thought this would be nice to just hang by like the door of our suite. And this one, I believe I got at Target. Command strips and command hooks are going to be your best friend in college because we're not allowed to poke holes in any of the walls so this is going to be the only way my stuff will hang up i'm pretty sure i bought these from like amazon and target but honestly they're command hooks you can find them literally anywhere next thing that i have is a shower caddy and i got this from bed bath and beyond and this is obviously really helpful because when i go to the shower i'll have all of my toiletries and stuff already packed in here and there's so many pockets on the side which is really good Plus, it has holes so the water will just flow through. It won't, like, collect in here. So that's good. And it's also got a little thing for my phone. And I don't know why I'd be using my phone in the shower, but, you know, if that's something you do, then you do you, fam. So the next thing that I got that's probably really essential for all college students is a Keurig. Because every college student will develop a caffeine addiction at some point. It's just inevitable. So I figured might as well be prepared. And this is just... This is the K-Mini. I got it in gray, and I got this from Target on sale. Okay, the next thing that I got is this giant... <laughs> this looks so huge! It's this giant wall grid, and basically you like hang it on your wall, and you use like clips like these to clip pictures or paper, whatever you want. I plan to put all of my Polaroids on here, like above my bed. And you don't know how tempting it is to pop this bubble wrap right now, but no, I need to save it because I don't want it to get destroyed in shipping. And yeah, both the grid and like the clips that go along with it, I got from Amazon. So the next thing I have to show you is this desk lamp that I got from Target, I believe. And this is really good because it has these like organization things on the bottom. Plus, it's got like a plug in here and a USB port, so I'm prepared, fam. So, the next thing that I have to show you guys is this giant... <laughs> I went so overboard with this. Wow, okay. It's this giant poster slash art print of a map of New York City. I got the print from Society6, and the frame I got from Target, I believe. But basically, like, I'm from Long Island, and I go into New York City a lot to the point where, like, I can navigate the city better than I can navigate my own hometown in the suburbs, which is really bad. But this place has become like a home to me. And since I'm going to college in Philadelphia, it'll be a lot harder to head into New York City if I wanted to. So I figured I'd take a piece of home with me. And my plan is to have this like giant art print picture gallery thing hanging above my bed so this is going to be the main centerpiece because it's freaking huge so since i showed you guys like the big art print i might as well show you all the smaller art prints that i wrapped in bubble wrap because we don't want them to break so i can't take them out of the bubble wrap which is unfortunate but the first print that i have is this like paint splatter of the world map and i actually made all of these prints on my own and I made this because like one thing I really want to do before I die is travel the world and I want to have this just to remind me of that goal. Also, all of the frames, they came in a set that I got off of Amazon. So. 
There you go. The next print that I made is just this one. It says love yourself more because in high school I kind of struggled with that and I don't really want the same thing to happen to me in college so I printed this out as just a little reminder. The next print that I'll show you guys is this print of like a flower doodle thing and if you're any normal person that's all it is to you it's just like a piece of doodle art but if you're an army then you know that this is the album art to love yourself her and i made this for a number of reasons one being like it's one of those if you know you know things like if you know what it is then you know what it means and the meaning behind it is like just love yourself so again it's like another little subtle reminder to love myself but also it's cute and like if you don't know what it means then it just looks like a piece of art to you and that's cool and then the last print that i have is just this one that i made it says get shit done but i saw this online for like 16 dollars and i was like i can totally make this on my own so i did and i made the colors different so that it matches the aesthetic so the next thing that i have to show you guys is this oh my god oh my god <laughs> these are clothing hangers i know they don't look like it but i swear they are i don't like how does hold on how does this even work I give up. These are clothing hangers. They're pretty self-explanatory. I use them to hang my clothes in my wardrobe. And I honestly don't know where these are from because my mom just randomly got them for me, but I'm gonna say container store. Oh my god, did I just break it? No, we're good. We're good. We're Gucci. So the next thing I have here are these string lights, and these aren't actually going to go in my like dorm dorm this is gonna go in the common room for my suite i found these and i thought that these would look really cool and my roommates agreed so i got them the next thing that i have here is a brita filter um because we actually got lucky and we have a full-size fridge in our dorm so we'll be able to keep this and it'll be really good to have filtered water every morning so i can just pour it into my water bottle and i'm good for the day Funny story actually, there was a little bit of a miscommunication and apparently my other roommate was gonna bring her own. I didn't know that, so I got this and then she was just like, okay, you can bring it. And I was like, thank you for not making me return this. So shout out to you, Nikki. Thanks for letting me bring the Brita. <laughs> so the next thing that I have here is this like chalkboard, whiteboard thing. Pretty sure this came from the container store, but I think I'll just put this like over my desk or something and I'll write like a nice little message like, hey, get out of my room. Something inviting like that. So yeah, it's just another cute little piece of decorations to have. Okay, so the last thing that I have to show you guys is this foldable ottoman thing and this like, this is like its own separate part and it'll like make a box. And I got this because I wanted some extra storage, but also like my bed will be elevated like three feet into the air and I won't be able to step on it on my own. So I need like a step stool or something. So I figured getting a storage ottoman would be more convenient because then it's a step stool plus more storage in one. So yeah, and I got it in white, so it'll look really cute. So that was all for the dorm haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know it was a lot of stuff, but you know what? It's college. I'm just really happy and I'm really excited to move in. If you made it to this point in the video, then you are a very good human. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye!